Castle Canada. All right. Castle Canada. Canada. Not Canada. Canada. I should should be able to handle that. We could cause a distraction. Sneak in. No. We walk in the front gate. Kotun Khan set fire to our best swordsmen. Humiliated my uncle. Butchered the warriors of Tsushima. I'm going to repay his kindness. By repeating the same mistakes that got your friends killed. That's what the Mongols will think. But this time, I'll strike first. So we've seen this a couple of times already where she's saying, like, let's go quiet and take them out. And he's like, no, we face them. Head on. Wait here until I finish them. Standoffs. When approaching enemy territory, you can challenge foes to a standoff. Once your enemy approaches, hold triangle. As soon as they attack, release triangle to defeat them in one deadly strike. I've come for oh, shipping. cool. Let's go. Alright. So as soon as he does something, I'm in. Ooh. Oh. That's like, that's tense. See that attack that that takes really long that thrust. You did it. Don't sound surprised. What's all that noise? Not sure. Almost oh, we got more. The beach. Ooh. Whoa, that was close. She did get one. Just non stop. <laughs> okay. I guess I should probably be healing. Almost non-stop if we get that resolve back from kills. Keep moving. We can't retreat. Whoa. Are you kidding? Oh, oh that's her. Nice. What the hell? <laughs> Whoa. We can't keep going. I have to. Fall back. Alone? Keep the path clear. When I find Lord Shimura, we'll need a quick escape. I'll get the horses ready. Do it. If I'm not back soon, ride for the forest. Nice. Oh, there we go. Okay, so there's like breaking that defense in a more practical way. In like a normal setting. They're starting to throw like all the different uh, all the different styles at us. Very cool. Oh. Yeah, a ton of resolve. Wow, okay. Look at this. Oh man, this is gonna be amazing. Okay. This is gonna be so cool. 
before you head up, I don't know if there's much off the beaten path right now, but... Keep throwing them at us. Dodging arrows. Before firing arrows, Mongol archers will call out and signal their allies to duck. Oh, there we go. How many are there? Four? Sure, that seems reasonable. Fight me. Oh, I love this. I guess the standoffs is a way of, like, just immediately getting rid of one. I don't know about this. I am Jin Sakai, nephew of Lord Shimura. I have come to avenge his honor. Whoa. Your uncle has told me much about you, Jin Sakai. I will show him his nephew, broken and humiliated, begging to join the Mongol Empire. Jin. <laughs> this is your time, Lord Sakai. We got this. <laughs> what could go wrong? I'm here to No pressure. Submit, Slit your throat. Whoa, what is that? Oh, he did a circle. Or, uh. Whoa. <laughs> We've only seen, like, the spear thrust when it glows. How easily he can bring peace to your home. Save yourself. Oh, 
okay. No way. Young master, it's time. I'm coming, Yuriko. Yuriko. So I was wondering... Island has come to mourn your father. Can't you send them away? You must face them, Jin. You are now the master of Clan Sakai. Yes. You're not alone, Jin. Your father is the wind at your back. Your mother, the birds in the tree. And uncle? He will tell you at your father's pyre. Thank you, Yuriko. I was wondering what happened to the father. We were training with our uncle. And not only did we lose him, but we were we were scared. We hid. And, when, and our father watched us hide. The last thing he saw before he died is watching us hide in fear. Ooh. If you ever need guidance, Clan Adachi will help you. Clan Adachi. Your father protected the people above all else. A true samurai. Shikawa. Oh, man. I couldn't save him. Yep. I was a coward. Jin, you are a samurai. He died because of me. Your father fell in battle saving his only son. His reward is a warrior's death. Now you will carry on his legacy. Your father's spirit resides within this blade. He is always with you. No hesitation, just immediately takes us under his wing, too. Like, that's probably expected in the tradition, I imagine.
The wind in our backs, like she said. Follow the wind. Oh, cool. Like, this is absolutely stunning. You know, oh, you know. Jin, what happened? I found Lord Shimra. I could have saved him, but the Khan was there. I failed my uncle. At least you're in one piece. I swore to protect this island with my life. But now the Mongols have stolen our home. Killed our samurai. You forgot what it's like to fight someone stronger than you. To feel weak. Sometimes when you're staring death in the face, you have to do whatever it takes to survive. The Khan expects to fight a war against the Samurai. He will anticipate our every move. Unless we find new ways to surprise him. That's how we'll save Lord Shimura. And retake our home. You'll need some help. Riders. The Khan's attack dogs. There's too many of them. Hide in the grass. Oh. Nice. We have murder bushes. The Japanese voices are so good, too. I contemplated playing with the Japanese voices and just having the English subtitles, but... I feel like from a viewer's perspective, it's Bastards much easier everything being in English. Mounts, trained to return to their masters. Here! Nobu! Oh, good Nobu. Nice trick. The Mongols must be hunting you. We should split up. I'll draw their attention while you escape. I'm not leaving your side until we've saved my brother. First, I need to find more allies, trained warriors, like Sensei Ishikawa and Lady Masawadachi. They can help. My brother can help too. Once we save him, you'll have the island's best blacksmith in your debt. He'll make whatever tool you need to save your uncle. Something to scale the castle walls? You dream it, Taka can make it. Okay. Where are they holding him? He was captured near Kechi. Ride there and ask around. I'll join you soon. Taka won't last long in the Mongol cage. You know, we will save your brother. And your uncle. We both have some skin in the game. Wow. This is, it's unfair how gorgeous this is. Unbelievable. They've nailed it. Oh, look how we're like putting our hand in the foliage as we go by. Aqua and rescue Lord Shimura. <laughs> yes. 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 Lake Izuhara. 
Flying Tsushima, map and journal now available. Oh. All right, what do we got here? Tsushima Island. Explore Tsushima to discover new locations. This is a tale. The Warrior's Code. Complete tales to build your legend and acquire new resources and abilities. So Yuna is searching for her brother, a blacksmith named Taka, who's been captured by the Mongols. She's checking on a lead near Ketchy Fishing. And it tells you what your reward is, too. Focused hearing. I don't know what that is. Uh, some type of assassination reward. That's cool. And a major legend increase. As your legend grows, you'll learn powerful new techniques. So that's got that's like XP, I guess. Choose your next destination and the wind will guide you. Tale of Sensei Ishikawa. He was the guy on the stairs, right? So we can learn uh, archery, half bow, and a major legend increase. It says Tale 1 of 9. Never joined our battle against the Mongols at Komodo Beach. If he's still alive, I could use his skill with... What? Show in the journal. Find Yuna south of Ketchy Fishing Village. Items and resources you collect are stored in the collections menu. Okay, let's just take a quick look here. So here's what we got going on. Progress-wise, Act 1, Rescue Lord Shimura. So we need to recruit Sensei Ishikawa, uh, Lady Masako, and Yuna's blacksmith brother. Uh, the two active tales that we have, which I guess are both of those things, uh, two of the three things above. Uh, the Warrior's Code, and the Tale of Sensei Ishikawa. So we can track these, we can sort them, we can show on the map. Alright. She should join her before she runs into trouble, but first I have to find the Sensei. Those are the parts that were cut off. Okay. Okay. So I think we'll go and help her first. Uh, Gear-wise, let's just take a quick look here. Sakai Katana. For generations, the head of the Sakai clan has wielded this matchless blade. I hope we have some really cool, uh, like... Fashion Ghost of Tsushima happening. I'd be into it. Kill enemies faster. Oh, it's just like increases damage as you go. Supplies, iron, steel, gold. Gold seems to be a bit more rare. Empty charm slots. Charms grant perks. Earn them by honoring Shinto shrines and by completing Tales of Tsushima. Okay. Unlock additional charm slots by honoring Inari shrines. The regalia of the Sakai clan, right hand of the Jito. Okay. Outfit-wise, you've got helmet slots, mask slots, armor slots. Ours is broken. <laughs> Been damaged beyond repair. Oh, hold on. The will of a warrior is timeless and untouched by death. That'll work. New upgrades can be purchased by visiting an armorer. No mask. And then accessories. We've got storm wind. Those who see this saddle know that a terrible storm approaches. Okay. Oh, this is going to be sick. The sun's warm embrace. A song that can change the weather. Play flute melodies by swiping left on the middle pad. Huh. A song that can change the weather. Sun's warm embrace. Find singing crickets to learn new songs that can change the weather. So we can make it uh, warm out, storm, fog, raindrops. I wonder if these have like strategic imp implications as well. Uh, here's our satchel. Just looking at some different things that we can collect. Different types of woods. Iron, steel, gold. Uh, silk. So these are all used by armorers. These are swordsmiths. Uh, bowyers to upgrade ranged weapons. And then supplies. Can be traded with trappers, swordsmith, armors, or bowyers in exchange for additional resources and upgrades. Colorful flowers used by merchants to create new armor dyes. These flowers grow throughout the wilderness of Tsushima. Oh, cool. Hides of dangerous animals that can be traded with trappers to upgrade the amount of ranged and quick fire weapons you can carry. <laughs> okay. All the guiding wind to reach a tracked objective. Swipe up on the middle pad to gust the wind and show your objective. Whoa, that is so sick. Phew. 
That's just a really, really clean implementation of like a waypoint system. Big mountain in the background. Can we get off the horse? I want to see what happens if we... Like this might be considered sunny. Look, it's clearing up. That's unbelievable. <laughs> All right. Quickly, number. We can have problems here. Mongol territory. Yep, certainly seems like it. Okay, so we got to be on the eye for any type of uh, potential resources. Whoa. Should we go in for a standoff? Let's go. Okay, now. There we go. Okay, that guy's got a different weapon we haven't seen. I imagine that's like a dodge thing. Yep. Okay, he's quick too, actually. That's so sick. And they drop supplies sometimes. Travelers rest in, defeat the Mongols. This isn't even where we... This isn't where she's at, so... What the? Thank you. Uh, you're welcome. Deal. One thing I always look for in these types of games is um, just kind of how organically things fit together. What I mean by that is, you know, we're heading to one location, but then along the way, there's other stuff that you kind of run into and it can distract you from your ultimate goal. Mongol artifacts, one of 50 collected. Mongols often appropriate weapons and tools from the Persians and Chinese and improve on them. Mongol riders wield a wide variety of weapons. Often they attach a dagger to their left arms to be used when necessary in close range fighting. One of 50. All right. A little bit of lore. Never killed anybody or did it. Oh, there's a few more. That dude looks a little bit more intense. He's stuck. <laughs> Too bad for him. Oh no, I can't see anything here. Oh, 
Bow. Nice. Leader killed. Killer observe more leaders to unlock water stance too. What does that mean to observe leaders? I don't know what it means, but it's awesome. End suffering? Yep. Get a ton of resolve from that too. Okay, this is unbelievable. <laughs> this is so good. We can take a look around to see if there's anything else. So I don't know if this is considered like a little outpost That's or... Weird. Or what, but um, once we clear it, we should probably just double check the buildings to see what kind of things might be inside. Hello. Uh, just different ways of approaching the situation, maybe. Yeah, and see here's like the flip up doors. Oh, for like stealthing around and stuff, we're gonna have a ton of options. I don't know how rare these materials are either, but... Might as well grab what we can. Oh! No way! Yes! <laughs> That's so cool. I'm seeing a lot of, like, stealth possibilities. Okay, let's go get, uh, let's go get Yuna. Or the brother. The Mongol Empire is invading our home. They are brutal. Relentless. 